Hello, I'm Kim Linder, your host of the Caregiver Hour radio show. I've brought you into one of my favorite places. It's called Serenity Now Books and Gifts in Palm Harbor, Florida. This is where I came when, as an active caregiver for my in-laws, I would come and just escape here. It is so peaceful with the music, the aromatherapy, and the wonderful energy that happens inside this, this, this beautiful shop. But sometimes I would take elements in the store and just sit with them, and sometimes I would buy them too, like this rose quartz that's for emotional well-being and health, and just help me create that balance as a caregiver for my in-laws. But even as a professional caregiver, taking care of other people's stress and their stories would just kind of deplete me. So, so often I would need to feel recharged and re-energized and use the rose quartz to help me do that. This is just a place that has so much wonderful energy, positive energy, that helps you recharge and re-energize your spirit as a caregiver. As a caregiver, we face so many challenges, and sometimes things are going really well for a little while, and all of a sudden, there's that bump. And when you have that bump in the road, it's nice to find a place where you can come and really feel taken care of, and feel nurtured, and feel that there's good energy all around you. Our guest is going to be John Graham, where he wrote a book with his sister, Sharon Graham Niederhaus, a book called Together Again, A Successful Guide to Intergenerational Living. John and Sharon went and interviewed over a hundred families in the United States and asked them how they were handling their caregiver situation when they were all living together in one home. This is very interesting because we normally think of our caregivers just going into assisted living or even a nursing home, but some families are thinking differently, and actually 50 million are thinking differently. They're thinking of how to bring their loved one back in their home and making those adaptations. Our show is going to be talking to John and asking him the questions about what did you learn when you were on the road asking these families? What changes are they making? And how are they making these adaptations living as a whole family again? Tune in this Monday, February 21st at 11 a.m. to 12 noon Eastern Standard Time on 1250 a.m. WHNZ.